Toronto is participating in what's being billed as the first ever citywide program to test and rate the indoor air quality of spaces where people work, shop and gather. The city is partnering with Breathe Easy, using its 20 minute rapid air safety test to determine the ratings. So what the system does is it releases uh, droplets into the air that are like human breath and they, they move the way that human breath does in the space and are cleared by HVAC filters, by air purifiers, by the native air motion and air system in the building, as well as natural ventilation. And what the sensors do is they measure how quickly these particles are, are cleared from the space. When the release turns off, the system then measures the air change rate of the space. So far, nearly 130 locations in the 50 busiest blocks of downtown Toronto, including the City News newsroom, have been tested to provide a vivid day-in-the-life view of airborne infection safety and risks. The top performers? Uh, Scotia Plaza, uh, 700 University and Atrium on Bay were some of the top performers. Uh, they're run by Kings at Capital. Another top performer is co-working space IQ. Uh, we started using that technology as a way of creating really safe spaces throughout IQ. It is a way to take the invisible and make it visible. So we were able to find out if there are airborne contaminants in our space, also do swabbing as well with through in our space, throughout our space, to see if there is any COVID or any sort of bacteria or any problems with the space that we need to do to pay attention to. On the city's partnership, Mayor John Tory says in part, with Breathe Easy TO, we've shined a light on the safe city of Toronto environments we've created for the public and public workers through our investments in ventilation over the past three years, as well as the places we will keep improving. According to Breathe Easy's public ratings, one area that needs improving is the path near First Canadian Place. If there's somewhere you want the air quality tested, the public is now being invited to vote on spaces in Toronto. For more information on that, you can head to our website, citynews.ca slash extras. So we did the test here in the City News newsroom, and here is the result. We got a score of 18.8. This is considered a Breathe Easy platinum rating. Yes, please. A plus. And here's what this rating actually means. Hypothetically, with regular occupancy in the newsroom, we could actually live here for two weeks. And even if one person was sick, we are 90% confident that the virus would not spread. Michelle Mackey, City News.